What's going on, Herman Nation? We're here at the Abdominal Crunch Hammer Strength Machine, and I'm going to show you guys how to use this machine a little differently than it's intended to, to target more of your lower abs, okay? What you want to do is you want to put it on a light weight first. I'm going to put it on 20 pounds, okay? And then what I'm going to do is adjust the seat to my height. For most people, if you just take your fist and stick it in here, and kind of line it up, that's usually good enough for you. What you want to do is make sure that your shoulders are about at this point, okay? So I'm going to sit down. Now normally when you do this machine, you're going to put your feet behind the pads. Now what we're going to do is hold our feet out in front. You can put your feet together if you want to. You can hold them apart. It doesn't really matter. I like holding mine together. You're going to lean back, okay? Now you don't want to let your feet hang down like this. That's very important. You actually do want to stick them out because that's going to help you put more of the tension right here. You're going to maintain a neutral spine. You're going to look straight ahead the whole time. You're going to breathe out as you crunch down. Hold your elbows in nice and tight. And you're gonna go like this, okay? Or you can keep a nice bend in your knees, actually. That feels a little better. Just don't have them like that. Hold them out a little bit. And now what I'm doing is I'm forcing myself to relax my legs and by not having them underneath here to create the tension to pull more weight, it's bringing the energy down to here, okay? So make sure you give it a shot. A lot of gyms now have this machine. So that's why I like demonstrating it. But this will definitely help you target your lower abs a little more. And as you get stronger, you can do more weight. So, for more great information, feel free to check out more of my videos. And as always, more good stuff coming soon. See you guys.